So in the last two videos of the series of subjects of BTEC Food Technology, I covered all the different subjects that we have to read in first year and second year. Now this is the correct time to discuss what are the different subjects that we have to read in the third year, which means fifth and sixth semester. So without wasting much time, let's get started. So hello guys, my name is Trans. I'm a third year student of BTEC Food Technology and on this YouTube channel, you will get all information regarding food technology and its application. So if you end up liking this video, make sure to hit the subscribe button, press the bell icon for the future updates. So these are the subjects of third year as you can see on your screen. And as always, I will give you a general idea that in each subject, what are the different topics that we have to read? See, I am not going to cover all the topics. I will give you a general idea that what we have to read. Okay, so let's explore what we have to read in each and every single subject. First is importance of computerization and IT in food industry, which include role of computer in food industries. Introduction to operation research. What are the roles of computer in history? Computer oriented algorithm approach. Problem solving with computers. Flowchart algorithm development and all topics related to this. Practical part of this subject is also very important which includes use of word processing softwares for creating reports and presentation, different windows and their utilities, handling of arrays, matrices and many more. Next subject is marketing management and international trade which includes about marketing, its functions, scope, process, world consumption of food, features of international marketing and so on. Next subject is processing of spices and plantation crops. Okay, so by the name of the subject, it is pretty clear that what we have to read in the subject like about different type of minor spices, different type of major spices, study about all type of spices, its production, its processing, its flavor, packaging, extraction, what are the different byproducts of spices and plantation crops and a lot more. Practical side include obviously identification and characterization of spices, identification and characterization of different flavors compound of spices, chemical analysis of spices, packaging study of spices and a lot more. Now next subject is processing technology of fruits and vegetables in which we have to study about processing techniques, equipments, canning of fruits and vegetables, commercial processing technology of selected fruits and vegetables. Practical part include processing of selected fruits and vegetables, canning of different fruits, preparation of jam, jellies, preparation of dried ginger, preparation of pickles and a lot more. Next subject is processing of meat and poultry products. Okay so if you are vegetarian then this subject is very challenging. Okay, so this subject include sources and importance of meat and poultry, mechanical grading, aging, eating and cooking quality of meat, preservation of meat by chilling, freezing, cooking, pickling, smoking and a lot more. Practical part include study of post-mortem changes in meat, meat cutting and handling, preservation of meat by freezing, preservation of meat by dehydration, evaluation of quality and grading of eggs and a lot more. Now next subject is instrumental techniques in food analysis which include concept of food analysis, rules and regulations of food analysis, principles and different methodology involves in analysis of food, different sensors for food flavor and a lot more. Practical part includes sensory evaluation of product quality, evaluation of raw materials of fruits and vegetables, cereals, dairy products, meat, etc. Quality evaluation of food product for color and taste of marketed products and a lot more. Next subject is food processing equipment design which includes materials for fabrication, mechanical properties, ductility, hardness, operating conditions, design of different shells and its component and a lot more. Practical part include design of different shells design of plate heat exchangers, tube heat exchangers, design of crystallizer, design of single and multiple effect evaporator and a lot more. Next subject is food storage engineering in which we have to study about climatic and non-climatic fruits, changes during ripening of fruits, direct damages, indirect damages, causes of spoilage in storage like moisture, temperature, humidity, etc. Source of infestation and its control and all type of topics which is important for the storage of any food product. Practical part include traditional storage structures, their layout, design, storage capacity. Also include visit to evaporative cooling system for storage. Next subject is bakery, confectionery and snacks products 
my favorite one which include type composition ingredients specification formulation processing equipment packaging storage and quality testing of bakery products and confectionery and snacks products too and a lot more practical part include identification and composition of various ingredients for snacks confectionery and bakery products different type of floors their classification and characterization visit to bakery confectionery and snacks industry is also included which is very important okay so these are the subjects of fifth semester by the way in the sixth semester again we have to read a lot of subjects okay so have a look of sixth semester subjects first one is instrumentation and process control in food industry which includes all type of instrument which is used in food industry like potentiometer register thermocouples thermometer landline radio frequency transmission channels media receiver and transmitter display devices xy recorders smart sensors a smart transmitter and many more Next subject is project preparation and management which include overview of project management functions of management project life cycle project selection project planning scheduling the project project implementation monitoring and control project completion and also future direction and all other topics related to this next subject is processing technology of beverages which include all type of beverages fruit beverages alcoholic beverages tea coffee different plant extracts etc fssai specifications for beverages its ingredients manufacturing packaging for different beverages quality test and control in beverages and a lot more related to different types of beverages practical part include quality analysis of raw water preparation of flavored beverages quality analysis of tea and coffee preparation of miscellaneous beverages visit to mineral water plant and a lot more next subject is food plant sanitation which is very important as it includes operating procedures good laboratory practices sanitation in food industry sanitation laws guidelines and regulations personal hygiene and sanitary food handling protection against contamination role of hacp in sanitation and a lot more this subject include practical part also which includes topics like distribution of biological oxygen demand determination of hardness of water sewage treatment primary secondary tertiary quaternary biodegradation of phenolic compound and a lot more next subject is food packaging technology and equipment which include all about packaging what is the need of packaging packaging requirement packaging functions package material and a lot more related to this in practical part it includes classification of various packages based on material and rigidity measurement of thickness of paper paper boards and all type of different topic which is related to packaging next subject is processing of fish and marine products which include fisheries resources types of fish other marine products classification of fish its composition characteristics of fresh fish and a lot more practical part include obviously study of anatomy and dressing of fish different type of fish selection and grading chilling and freezing of fish preparation of fish meal and all topic related to fish and marine products next subject is sensory evaluation of food products which includes introduction importance definitions of sensory evaluation in relation to consumer acceptability terminology related to sensory evaluation principle of good practice different type of test and a lot more practical part include determination of threshold value for different test order recognition next subject is very interesting which is food additives and preservation which include obviously different type of food additives preservatives which increase the value of food which enhance the taste of food texture of the food overall shelf life of the food like different type of food colors chemical action production of enzymes leavening agents and a lot more practical part includes identification of different types of food color isolation of naturally occurring food pigments role of stabilizer and thickener in frozen dairy products and a lot more finally the last subject of 6th semester is food quality safety standards and certification which includes obviously about food safety food quality definitions and its role in food industry to read about what are the safety standards that each and every one should follow that each and every company should follow factors influencing acceptance and preference and a lot more okay so these are the subjects that we have to read in third year see i didn't included all the topics of each and every single subjects or i only i'm giving you an overall idea that okay we have to read these subjects and in that subject we have to cover these topics i am just giving you an general idea so hope you like the information if yes like this video see you soon in my next video thanks for watching love you all